Don't forget to check out my Patreon where we have exclusive content for groups such as Twice, Seventeen, Red Velvet, Black Pink, NCT, Super M, Shiny, AT, Stray Kids, and so much more along with K-dramas, concerts, and other variety shows. Hey guys, Angie here, and I'm so excited because today we have Mark Twan. Mark Twan. Why do I always feel like I say his name wrong? Reads Thirst Tweets. And then I actually, I watched Eric Nam. Of course, I watched Eric Nam. Um, with his original Thirst Tweets, but apparently he has part two, and I don't think I've seen it. So we're gonna watch it, and if I have seen it, I don't remember, so we're gonna watch it. I've seen Eric Nam's original one. Also, I have seen JB do his, I've seen One Hole do his. If I haven't reacted to it, I've already seen it. Like, Jesse's and all of them. Um, I, I, I reacted to Jackson's and B.I.'s in one video together. Also, if my throat sounds jacked up, it's because it is. I have COVID. Yay! Um, but I do still want to watch some videos. I'm watching way less than usual, and I'm doing shorter ones. Um, so I'm not just coughing the whole time. But, yeah. Bear with me. Um, but yeah, I, I'm excited because Mark's my bias, along with Youngjae. I'm waiting for the day Bam Bam does his. I feel like Bam Bam would be funny. I would love to see Youngjae and Jin Young, but I feel like I want to protect them. Yukiyam would be cool. I feel like Yukiyam would do it. Um, I don't know. I feel like Youngjae and Jin Young are a bit more... I don't know. I feel like Youngjae would last uncomfortably the whole time, and Jin Young would just be judging. Mark... I could see him either judging or playing into it like Jackson did. So let's hop into the video. Also, I might react to Mark's album. <laughs> He's so cute. I might react to it. I haven't listened to it yet. Um, he did bombard my subscription box with his songs. <laughs> but I might react to it. Maybe I'll do it tomorrow. Um, I was like, maybe I'll listen to it on my own. But like I did with Jackson's... Um, album that like it didn't leak but like it came out late it was supposed to be released like years ago i think jackson's having an actual physical album for once we'll definitely react to that but i think i might do marks i don't know oh all right let's start i'm also nervous for him mark twan has abs i am weak um goodbye okay i don't have abs mm -hmm. feel like they only show sometimes in certain then there are abs that's not, that's not too bad that Bloody mark twan with my man's head I don't have abs. They only show up sometimes in certain pictures. So you do have abs. I think um, everyone kind of disagrees or agrees with like what's considered abs. He's probably toned. Maybe he doesn't have abs. I don't think I've seen him with abs. I think he just has like a flat tummy. Really hit my ovaries differently. <laughs> I don't get. Oh, that he's sweaty so cute. He I mean, doesn't. I agree. Wearing, like super thick. Jackets. Yeah, Mark's Mark's doing the um the who was it? Who was it one or was it JB? I don't know, someone would just properly respond to Oh, it was BI. He like properly responded to them. Because he was uncomfortable. I think that's what Mark's doing. I don't know what to say. Um, thank you or that's supposed to be a compliment, right? I'm kind of scared to open all these. Okay. Mark Twan, if you lick your lips one more time, sir, I will be forced to marry you. That's kind of a bad habit of mine. Licking my lips. I've been I felt that, more I felt conscious that. about it, like trying not to do it. See, <laughs> he's you know, so cute. This video, but if I do, I guess you'll be forced to marry me. <laughs> His ears are so weird. Oh my god. Lips, I'm sorry. You know how people will drink a whole soda can and then put it on the ground and stomp it? That's what I want Mark Twan to do to me. <laughs> I used to do that. I used to stop on soda cans. I wouldn't want to do that to you. Um, I don't want to break anything. Yeah, I think we won't We won't do any stomping on anybody. I'm willing to trade my soul in exchange to Mark Twan's sweaty towel. Please let me have it. I do throw my towels um, at the crowd. Uh, see, that's what I, I love and hate. Because I... Oh, okay. I'm going to expose myself. I... I would want that, you know, like, but I think they know it too, so it's not that weird. It's, it's weird, but we all accept it. They do it. They know the towels are sweaty. They know the shirts are sweaty, but they still throw it because they know we want it. It's like a, it's a, like a recuperated, I can't, I, my brain's not working. I have COVID. <laughs> it's like um, a mutual understanding. They know it's weird and 
that we want it so they throw it and we know it's weird but we take it you know and i would also want that like i would definitely and i wouldn't wash it like because that's the whole point right i don't know is that weird i think you guys would wouldn't judge me too hard for that at the concerts so maybe the water bottle <laughs> thing's a little weirder and i don't you see he just said he does it but he doesn't know why we want it i don't know why we want it either like i don't know why i want it i guess because he touched it we need to go into like a deep like psychological understanding of why we want things people touch i guess it's because we like them and we we can't touch them they're on stage but if you throw something that you touch you, you know it's, I, I feel like there's like a really deep meaning behind it all. I wouldn't want anybody to study how Mark Twan thigh tattoo. Excuse me while I go feral. What does it mean to go feral? I just like the placement. I don't know if that triggers anybody like to go feral, but <laughs> <laughs> I guess everybody has their own preference. Right? Mark has such a dry humor. Me about Mark Twan's pink. <laughs> Is this the part of the video? There was like a, I think there was something in Jackson or BI's video where I just literally had to skip it because I was cringing, and I, I, I think this is one of those where I, I kind of want to skip it. <laughs> I don't know why I just want to skip it so bad because it's so uncomfortable and cringy. Oh, we had to skip five seconds. Okay. I don't show my nipples that often. There are some pictures out there. <laughs> Pepperoni nipples. I love Mark's laugh. He has such a squeaky laugh. He's so cute. He's that worse, right? Yes, I'm saying I would lick Mark Twan's sweaty. Oh, I want to die. Why do I watch these videos? It makes me uncomfortable. It really makes me uncomfortable. Oh my god, okay. I don't want to continue. <laughs> Pits, and what about it? Some of you guys are pretty pretty wild licking any and licking anybody's window. he's stuttering you got him stuttering i'm not sure about that <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I feel like okay. i'm being judged and i didn't write it why are you all so obsessed with nipples i never knew there was such an obsession like i get jin young's butt like yeah he has a cute butt like but why are y'all obsessed with mark's nipples <laughs> do i need to like look up his nipples are we gonna do that let's go ahead Okay, oh, y'all can't see the picture. I was about to say, when he said he doesn't go shirtless often, I was like, yeah, he doesn't. What? What? That's Jin Young. Why is there so much Jin Young? This is the one I think of the most because I think for a while that's the only time he's been shirtless. <laughs> and he's like a baby there. Yeah, I mean, it's a fine nipple. Like, I'll give it like a seven, but it ain't something to go feral about, guys. That's so obsessed with nipples. It's literally. The artist and their styles is laughing right now. <laughs> Sexualizing the members and tweeting thirst tweets. I already read the tweet and I want to die. It all needs to stop. Like, imagine one of the boys seeing them. It would be so embarrassing. Okay, now that they stopped reading, Mark Twain beat me like a zombie. You're crazy. <laughs> how many Hey Zaddies DMs will it take for Mark Twain to answer me? I don't know how many you sent, but you made it here. <laughs> Mark Twan, come here. I can't. Oh no, I because there's something different with Mark, not Mark, with Jackson reading their tweets. I don't feel uncomfortable. Not as much. Same with Eric now. I feel like there's like a, a mutual understanding like it's like it's like they recuperate same with like jesse and stuff jesse wanted more thirst sweets even one hole to an extent it's a little more like okay you know we got gotcha. you there's something about like bi and like mark and like reading oh yeah jb's i was kind of fine with it was a little uncomfortable sometimes but like there's something about mark and mark's not innocent that's the weird thing i don't like bi is kind of innocent <laughs> So that's why I was uncomfortable. I don't know why Mark- I feel like it's Mark scolding us and I feel like I'm being scolded but I didn't write them. I, I feel like Mark's like a, a good boy in terms of to the fans. So I feel like he's like shaming us right now. I feel like we're being shamed. 
even though we know he's hoeing out in the clubs but you know like, he, he's shaming us and i i completely understand i also shame us i am embarrassed on behalf i don't want to continue this video i want to skip to eric there's three minutes left let me eat your ass <laughs> That might have been the worst one right now. That's not sanitary, guys. <laughs> That's on best pussy. I never understood what this word meant. <laughs> Did they explain it? Okay. That's what it is. Um, they explained it. Thank you. I want Mark Twain to sit on my face. And oh my god, it. why did we just abruptly change to the dirty tweets? We abruptly- we didn't even lead into it. Oh my god. His thighs. My man looked so good. I feel like my thighs are pretty skinny. They I are. Why y'all? Like she said I look good. Oh, why they pick that picture, JP? To be dominant, but submissive on special occasions like your birthday. This isn't that bad, is it? I don't know if I'm dominant. I don't give off that kind of vibe, do I? Oh, oh, he said he ain't dominant. Okay. Mark, do you know what this means? He knows what this means. Mark's not innocent. Mark, are you admitting? To be oh okay all the Mark June shippers, it's time. I've been very much on the Jin Young dominant train. Um, you know it was a bit of a hard ride for a little bit, but Mark's finally admitted, and I'm so happy to see this day come through. I'm like y'all with the Mark Jin, where y'all all like, oh my gosh, Mark's such daddy, Jin Young's such baby. I'm like. I don't know, I kind of saw it the other way, and now here's the day it happened. Oh my god. It took me four years, but we finally made it. I've finally been proven. He admits it. He says he's not the dominant type. Right. Only sometimes when I get angry, I guess. Dad. Oh. Okay. Oh my god. I know every Mark Sand just melted there. They're like, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Hey, Rile him up. Mark Twain, sir. I'm just the whole. I couldn't do it. I couldn't watch that one. I want to choke you. Maybe. Oh, okay. Some other people would like. <laughs> oh, not me. Mark Tonka spit on me and I'd say thank you. I'm not this type of person that you guys are imagining or picturing. I mean, maybe if like on tour, you know, like accidentally I'm singing and, you know, some bit comes out, that's the only way, but. I want to spit on any of you guys. I, I like want to die. As I like Mark Twan. Why is the Mark video so hard to get through? Why is it so hard? Why is it so long? I'm gonna cry. Please stop. He's just a boy. He's just a 30 year old man. <laughs> oh, I can't do this. I can't do this. It's so hard. Okay, BuzzFeed, we see you. <laughs> I'm not even gonna answer. Mark Twan. Choke me. <laughs> <laughs> me. Make sure there is no I did not know what that word was. Wrap your hands around my throat and squeeze me until I can't speak. And Dang, sound. this girl's this spouting poetry. Tweets asking me to be choked. I wouldn't want any of you guys to have to risk your life or anything. So, I'll Mark's kink shaming. He's kink shaming. To be honest, I would not also. That's I wouldn't crazy. want to. I do not want you, but, but I do want raw sex with Mark. He read it. So he said the word sex so nonchalantly, it threw me off. Oh my god. Can we rewind? I don't know why I want to hear him say it again. He just nonchalantly said it. Like it was very jarring. It was so jarring. Okay, okay. I do not want children, but I do want raw sex with Mark <laughs> If he impregnates me and fertilizes my eggs, then too bad. For him, I'd accept to be a mom. Safe sex, everybody. Safe sex. <laughs> <laughs> I want to have sex with Mark. I want that on like a poster for like sex ed. Like if I was a teacher, I'd put that poster of Mark saying that and the quote there. It, it was beautiful. Mm -hmm. His voice was so sweet when he said it too. It's on until the room stinks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's cute and his body. This video is gonna be 20 minutes long. Yeah. I want to use his <laughs> as face moisturizer. I wanted. I can't I do mean, this. I mean, I've definitely seen like a couple of tweets before here and there, but nothing like this. 
I'm really curious on what's going through their mind when they're typing this. Um, it's just, I guess, how much they love me. So. I, I don't know, Mark. I don't know. Because I love, I listen, I'm not like an innocent stan, but I'm also like, I don't know. I also just don't tweet a lot. But I guess my feed is like the most sexual my feed gets is like if someone's like hip thrusting and like they're like, you know, like related to that. You know what I mean? This is a special side, side of Twitter. I feel like I saw most of those type of tweets and stuff when I was in One Direction, like when I was a stand of One Direction. And I guess because I was more... Maybe because, maybe it's that, that's the younger side of K-pop stands. Because like when I was in One Direction, I was in high school. When I was in One Direction, yes, I was the sixth member. When I was in the fandom, I was in high school, I guess, you were more hormonal. I never like tweeted much of it, but like I would see it way more. And I guess, I don't know, like I guess when you're older, you know, mature, wearing 101 Dalmatian sweater, you, you're more coddling. I don't know. What's the thank reasoning? You thank you, BuzzFeed, and thank you, everybody, for your thirst treats. I'm going to be on tour starting October. I saw. So I wanted to see him on tour. I think he's going to DC, maybe. But I just got COVID from seeing 17, so I don't know if I want to go to a concert anytime soon. Move on with my day. <laughs> Bye. Do you guys like Mipples that much? He's so cute. All right, Eric's going to be easier. What's up? I'm Eric Nam, and I'm here today to tell much. you about you. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Hey guys, what's up? My name is Eric Nam, and today I'm here at BuzzFeed to read your thirst tweets. Part two. Am I the first part two? Yeah, you might be the first part two. Wow, okay. Oh yeah, I guess he would be the first part two. I'm excited to be here, terrified, slightly nervous, scared, a lot of mixed They've emotions. They've gone dirtier since you, it. since you asked are. for your thirst tweets, which may or may not have been a mistake. It may have been a mistake. I haven't seen these, obviously. The first time was memorable. Oh man, you guys are so aggressive. Step on me. I'm not gonna step on you. If you pay me enough, I mean, anything's possible. I, I think, I think his caution. is actually pretty If your mom innocent. or dad or grandparent or relative is near you, get them away. Save this to your algorithm for later. Here we go. Oh God. I'll give you like $300 cash for you to step on me, please and thank you. No. I'm not gonna do it. You are worth more than three hundred dollars. That is and true. I my agree. My foot steppage is worth more than three hundred dollars. Also, very painful. I don't know why you would want that. Since the last Thirst Tweets video, by the way, the Lots signs step at my on concerts me, have become a lot more graphic. People have signs that literally just say "Step on me." How much is enough? I don't know. Maybe in part three we can answer how much is enough. I want Eric <laughs> to legally adopt me just so I can call him daddy. Listen, you can That's... call me whatever you want. You can call me daddy without me having to adopt you. Also, I heard adoption is really expensive. Raising a child is also very, very expensive. Schooling, clothing, feeding, that inflation. Is the goes on a I don't know if I can afford to raise it. a child right now. So I'm gonna respectfully decline. And I'm sure your parents are great. My, <laughs> I like my that ideal one. way is Eric Nam on I've top. I've seen those type of tweets more often. Thank you. I'll just say, I think I'm a lot heavier than I look, so maybe hard to breathe. You probably just have a lot just of depth physics. to you. What is with this? <laughs> excuse me, excuse me. Daddy, sorry. Daddy, sorry. Daddy, sorry. Daddy, sorry. Daddy. Why do you say it like that? I keep that? saying things on my socials where it's just people just keep calling me daddy. Honestly, don't know how to feel. Am I supposed to feel? You said we can call flattered? you one. I think I'm just confused. Just another good day. That would be better if Eric not would choke me. I want. I mean, this is six minutes, seven minutes long. I want him to get Jackson. No, because Jacksons were pretty tame. I want him to get Bi level of tweets of thirst tweets. Like Bi's were. The eyes were aggressively sexual. <laughs> My poor man was, he was scarred. I need that. Eric can handle it. You guys, a lot of issues going on. It's always been aggressive here. Steppage, choking, daddied. Is that a word? It's not gonna happen. I want you to breathe. I want you to live. I'll, <laughs> I'll lick Eric Nam's toes, dot, 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 for research purposes. Probably stinky, probably smelly, a little clammy. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna tell you. To deter you from licking my you know, toes. You know that probably made them one and more. I would like you to. It's just gonna be tickly. It's gonna be wet. <laughs> I'm kidding. I said that. Consent. It's me, it's not you. 
Oh my gosh. I <laughs> I let Eric Nam carve his name into my ovaries. That's, That's a conversation for another time. XOXO. This sounds like a XOXO conversation for girl. another time. That's painful. Any part of an internal organ having something carved into it has to be painstakingly horrendous. I love also, how much he I don't cares like for us. Sight of blood. Again, it's not a you thing, it's a me thing. <gasps> Choke me, slam me, hit me with your car, and I'll thank you. I think I know we what you're all... Trying to do here. You're trying to get an insurance payout. I'm not uh, here for it. Insurance rates are high. I think all these aggressive quotes have a lot to do with our generation wanting to die as they are but if we're gonna die we want to die from someone we love I'm not trying to go to prison no how do you like your eggs in the morning scrambled or fertilized i like mine fertilized. <laughs> i like that that's what you're not ready for children you're going to have to hold on to your eggs <laughs> sheesh someone mentions eric not me caution slippery when wet I love that so much. Because you're taking a shower. I get it. Because you're walking no, that was in the rain, me. down the subway stairs. They are very slippery when wet. Don't fall, hit your head. Safety first, guys. Well, then I need to say, Eric, I need you to braille me like we the last two people left on Earth. And we need to bring the Earth population back to 7 billion. Wow. I don't know if we could create that many children. Also, it's got to be very taxing on everyone. Seven billion's a lot. Have you washed your face today yet? I need to make sure my face <laughs> is clean. Early. You guys, these are, they're creative. I should really read through them before I read them out loud. No, I'm no, that's, red. That's like good. I feel my ears you are physically red. getting red right now. My face. I feel is like you was red before. Seat, okay. I do clean my face twice a day with some incredible K-beauty cleanser. I watched his routine. I shouldn't have asked to do this. I forgot how hard this is. I'm not into watching sunsets, but I'd love to see you go down. Down, 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 down. I have a song called Down For You. That's what this tweet is about. That I really that appreciate well. that you love the song so much that you, you tweeted this to me. Thank you. <laughs> Wow. Dear Eric Nam, I three. have three holes, but most three. importantly, a three. heart that could love you to pieces yeah, three. while you rip me apart. Thank you. I... Do you hear that? That is what's going through my head. You have a heart that could love me to pieces. Just aggressively love me. And I appreciate that. Hey, Eric, I'm going horseback riding next week, but I'm a little scared since it's my first time. Mind if I practice riding <laughs> I, think I personally less think that there are a lot of differences between I'm, human and horse. I don't think things. it would be good practice. I don't know. Save me here. Eric, what's the difference between me and sunglasses? Sunglasses sit higher on your face. Wait, what? Got it. You really thought that one through, didn't you? These people are so creative. How exactly. It's an art. It's an Since art. I don't have a driver's license, you can do the driving and I can do the riding. I'm a really good driver. My Uber Lyft rating How old is, is that person? I don't have well. a driver's license really either, but... Yeah, just let me know. I'm feeling like a young I can pick you up, drop you off, whatever you need. Be good. Oh, man. <laughs> Eric Nam? More like Eric Rabbit in my ass. Oh, my God. Lord, sheesh. You're gonna just pass on this one. I feel red. I appreciate the passion. I appreciate the love. It was so, so much, much easier to react to. I think it's because, face. like, the fact that this video we'll is be so long I was is like, simply hey, because Buzz of Mark. Can we do some stuff? Because everything new with Mark fell on the pop again. Again. and, like, I wanted to die. Everything's on ericnom.com. I forgot how I really wish this was. he Thank got you. some B.I.'s tweets. Bye. I feel like they did B.I. I feel like they thought B.I. Um, was like because of his, because he's a rapper and stuff. I don't know. I, I feel like BuzzFeed thought, like they didn't do enough research on B.I. Because I can't, I've been scarred myself from that video. And I feel like their expectations for him were so high and they didn't realize how innocent our man is. And not only that, but he's one of the few idols who were on here that he's fluent in English, very fluent, but not like born fluent, not like Jackson and Mark and, um, I mean, BM, um, BM, BI, oh my god, JB, uh, names, JB and Wanho also aren't born fluent, but like, 
they're pretty good at it and I feel like they're also just more sexy, like more sexual in terms of also just their music. P.I.'s lyrics aren't, like they're, he's a very deep, like, I don't know, I just felt like they expected differently from B.I. and I still feel bad about it to this day and I wanted Eric to have one of those type of tweets. But it, it got a little dirty, but mm, even even Marks were a little dirtier. I don't know, we need him to come on here and read some in-depth ones. But alas, that is it for this video. It's way too long. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!